Hola. Um, why did I say hola? Um, I'm going to try and film three videos. We'll see how we go. This is going to be empties, which always seems to be one of my most popular videos. So who knows? Don't question it. Just go with it, Hirons. And what I've brought up is two massive bags I've been saving of all the empties we've collated together. Um, and I haven't sorted through them. So it'll be a bit of a surprise to me as well. <laughs> I have two big things like this. So let's just pull out the first and start, shall we? Um, 40 real zingy limes. Oh, I believe that. But anyway, original source. We go through quite a few of these shower gels. The kids like them. The old man likes them. Not much to say, really. They're super, super cheap. 100% um, natural fragrance, vegan. I get it, but it's a stretch to put the word natural on the front of it. However, I like them and they're very zingy. Uh, next, I <laughs> just chucked it on the floor. I am going to recycle these by the way, and that's why I'm throwing them on the floor. Um, fresh sugar lemon body lotion. Oh, I love some fresh sugar lemon. Um, there is a little bit of dreg action going on in here. I might be able to get some out. It's just, if you have not smelt this, do your nasal area a favor and get thee to a fresh outlet, which I do believe is in Marlebone, and they're opening in Covent Garden, I do believe. Um, obviously, if you don't live anywhere near London, that's not gonna happen, but beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I don't know how many I've been through them in my lifetime because I have been using Fresh since 1998, I think. Um, okay, some hair. <laughs> this is a bit mullered. In fact, I'll keep it that way just for entertainment. Okay, I call this Rahua, but it's Rawa, or Rauha. It's not Rahua, Caroline. Um, so common. So this is the uh, Rainforest Grown Shampoo and Conditioner for healthy lustrous hair, for colour treated hair, which we all know with my Rod Stewart Barnet, that's what I am. I loved these clearly because they are done. I like chucking them on the floor. More hair, uh, Davines, which always reminds me of Davina McCall, so it's either Davines or Davines, sorry. And although it's called OI Conditioner, in my head I call it OI. <laughs> So that is it, if it's gonna focus, there we go. It's really, really lovely. I wasn't overly keen on the smell, but I kind of, it's, it's weird. It's like, I like it, but I don't, anyway. It's quite a strong scented product. Um, absolute beautifying conditioner. It is really, really lush. I've been taking such good hair of my, such good hair. I've been taking such good care of my hair lately. That, that's why there's so much hair product in it. I'm being heavy with the conditioners. I'm staying away from SLS still. I'm blow drying on a minimum. I had my hair blow dried this morning because my neck is sore and I can't really do all this action. Um, so I've been doing really well and it is really growing. So I'm chuffed to pieces. Um, where are we? Is this hair? Oh, more hair. <laughs> uh, green, green Routine, Jonathan Nourishing Conditioner. Always love this range and I love this conditioner. Oh, that smell is literally, it immediately reminds me of summer and working in Notting Hill and being in LA. Weird, but anyway. Glorious, gorgeous, organic, everything you would expect. Uh, this is Mullard. This is Frederick Fakai's Glossing Cream. Da 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 da, looks like that. And it's, I might cut it in half actually and see if I can get some out. It's, yeah, totally gone. This is really good for when you are, um, when you want to tame wispy bits or you're doing a light bun and you want to sort of smooth down pieces. That's what that's great for. Again, not my first one of those. Um, I'm on to some body. Oh God, look at the state of this. This is Clarins Moisture Rich Body Lotion. Um, yeah, that, I would normally take a scissor to it, but I vaguely remember holding it up to the light and there's no point. I literally managed to bend the bejesus out of it. Gorgeous body lotion, great for gifting, coming up to Christmas time, if any of my kids are watching. And then, oh my God, I loved this body cream. Josie Moran Whipped Argan Oil. This could not have got any more out of that if I tried. This, I believe in the UK is QVC only. I think it in the US, I don't know, sorry. I think it's still QVC, but other places. To say that this is a beautiful body cream is like saying Duran Duran are a good band. Any opportunity I get, people, any opportunity I get. At the other extreme, um, price-wise, but still completely all used up, is Creme de la Mer body cream. It looks like this. Again, great if you're going down the gifting road at this time of year. 
and again totally utterly destroyed i won't chuck this one on the floor i'm just going to place it because it weighs a ton oh skincare okay um sorry about me looking down but like i said i haven't checked what's in these bags i'm out of this and it makes me very sad because it's one of my favorite all-time moisturizers kate somerville nourish hard to go wrong light hydrating wet but not too heavy not too light almost my perfect moisturizer the only reason it's not perfect is because i can't get it in the uk very easily <coughs> um tata harper restorative eye cream i think this is my second possibly third i think second restorative eye cream that is mullard gone love it those of you who like your green and organic brands this should be top of your list i'm going to take a picture of the floor after this um this is actually actually my favorite eye cream of the year so far and it's not new and i have used it before but it definitely through the summer with the lack of sleep and the blah 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 it has helped with the dark circles it's kate somerville cytosel dark circle corrective eye cream that's it i like that it has the little windows at the side so when you've used it up you can tell it's near at an end and you start using less and less like i will drag it out um, I love, love, love this eye cream. Can we have Kate Somerville here? ASAP, hurry up. Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. That has a, see that teeny white bit at the bottom? Um, that's gone, dusted, mullered. I think actually this was what I used to always take on the airplanes. Oh, just a really good, good hydrating mist for stage two of toning, if you follow my routines. Don't know why I'm talking like this. SkinCeuticals AOX Eye Gel, also done. I get through a lot of things. I get through certain things very quickly. Body creams, conditioners, eye creams. I don't do the whole grain of rice and pat. I do eye cream, rub. So AOX Eye Gel, SkinCeuticals, another brand that it's hard to go wrong with. Uh, Estee Lauder, this has been before. This has been before, this has been in videos before. This is Double Wear Stay In Place Brow Lift Duo. Again, this end, hang on, oh, there's a sneaky peek where else is coming. This end is done, done and dusted, and the highlighting end, I have not touched. Never mind. But I still bloody love the eye pencil, the brow pencil, sorry. Last one in this bag, there's another bag, people, is Purology Color Stylist Fortifying Heat Spray. I got a sample of this at my hairdressers, loved it, and I kept it so I could remember to buy one. One bag down. Oh God, okay, this one I have to be careful with. I actually cut my hand, which is not great. And I know we've all had the same problem, but it's still one of my top five cleansers. Emma Hardy Moringa Balm, look at the state of that. I think it was a bit cracked and I have strong hands, as you can imagine. And when I turned the lid, it cracked into the palm of my hand. So not great, it totally comes apart, but I managed to salvage it throughout the big chunks that cut me. Um, but again, let me see if I can get the lid off without causing injury, hang on. Totally gone. <laughs> that actually, oh, excuse me. That looks like a big Nespresso pod. Look, that's the inside of the packaging. So that is definitely going in a bin because someone could do themselves an injury on that one. Oh, sorry. And we're back. Um, okay, this is all hair and body. So big sexy hair. You saw this, I bought it in LA. That is done and dusted. I will definitely repurchase, love it. Garnier Ultra Softening Lotion Green. I actually use the red more often. Speaking of red, like the manicure. OPI Gels, The Spy Who Loved Me, because I'm going to see James Bond tomorrow. Get in. Um, love Garnier body lotions. I go from really, really cheap and affordable to really, really expensive. I tend to use the expensive ones on the upper body and the cheaper ones down below. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Again, you saw these in LA. Again, they've been mullered and I wish I could fly back tomorrow and get more. Shea Moisture, Bubble Bath and Body Wash and Body Lotion. I hear that these are coming to Boots or they're already in Boots. So you know what I'll be doing this weekend, folks. Lush. Oh, I've got three left. And I'm keeping it under, what are we on? Nine minutes. Oh, it's a record for me. Um, hair, Alberto Balsam. This was in one of my What's New videos. The, one of the last videos I did, I think. That has been completely used up. Ava also is addicted to the smell, and since I used it, I cannot find it in any of my supermarkets. I can only get the smell I don't like. Really helpful, great. 
Organics, anti-breakage, keratin oil conditioner. You can see there's a theme this month, can't you? Fix the hair, fix the hair. Um, love OGX. We invested heavily in these whenever they're on a three for two. Oh, there's a bit of heaviness there. Maybe I'll get some out. Um, love, love, love. Again, hard to go wrong. And then this ran out and I'm so sad. Oh, this just reminds me of being in LA and sunshine and when you're in this weather, which is just basically grey. Think of a Sherlock Holmes film and fog and grey and that's the outside of my window. This, Essence of Beauty, Citrus Coconut Body Lotion. Um, I believe I bought this in Ulta, I believe. I think it was in the first shop we went into, which was an Ulta. I do believe that's where I got it. Um, love this, all gone. Basically, I'm gonna have to come to the States just to go shopping. I'm gonna take a picture with my vlogging camera, ah, here, of what's on the floor to use as a thumbnail, because that'll be quite nice. Um, that's it, basically. A ton of eye cream, a ton of conditioner, a ton of body products, eyebrow pencils, and a cleanser. Story of my life. Thanks for watching. Um, I don't know which order these are gonna go in, so I won't even bother doing some kind of funny sign off. Please subscribe. I had a target to get to by Christmas. I'm not gonna get there unless some miracle happens, but I would like to get to the three figures. I'm on about 76,000. I'd like to get up there. Um, but I appreciate all of you watching. I appreciate your comments and I'll see you soon.